Hi guys! Welcome to my channel. So before we get started make sure to hit that like button also subscribe to my channel. In this video, we will talk about Top 10 Best Places to Retire in Europe as of 2022 1. Algarve, Portugal Portugal's Algarve region is a land of superlatives. These 100 miles of coast offer 3,300 hours of sunshine each year and more sunny days than anywhere else in Europe as well as some of the best beaches in Europe and best golf courses in the world. According to the 2021 Global Peace Index, Portugal is the fourth safest country in the world, and the Algarve region is perhaps the most crime-free in the country. English is widely spoken, thanks to a decades-long connection with Britain, and the cost of living in the Algarve is one of the most undervalued in Europe. In 2012, Portugal introduced its Golden Visa program, one of the best in the EU. Retirees can also establish residency in this country simply by showing a minimum monthly income of just 1,070 euros. 2. Annecy, France The big attraction of Lakeside Annecy, the pearl of the French Alps, is its ski slopes in winter. But this is an appealing place to be year-round. In summer, the lakeshore bustles, but not only with tourists. Unlike other top ski destinations in France, Fairy Tale Annecy is not a tourist town, but a living community that is more cosmopolitan than a typical haunt of Euro snow bunnies. Annecy has been awarded the titles of City of Art and History and also City in Bloom and can seem like an open-air museum. Every July its streets are given over to Noctibules, an annual art festival. And every August, the much-anticipated Fate du Lac features the biggest fireworks show in Europe. 3. Ljubljana, Slovenia Slovenia, nestled among Italy, Austria, Hungary, and Croatia in the heart of Central Europe, is a mountainous country with 30 miles of Mediterranean coastline. Old world capital city Ljubljana is the heart of the country, literally and figuratively, with easy access to both beaches and ski resorts. Ljubljana is a modern city with all the amenities of 21st century, living that manages to retain a small-town charm. Local farmers bring their produce to market in wooden carts each day. You could embrace this old-world lifestyle supported by top-notch infrastructure on a budget of as little as €1,400 a month. 4. Cascais, Portugal A miles-long stretch of sheltered coves, sandy dunes, and rocky outcroppings, the coast of Cascais, Portugal, offers some of the best beaches in Europe, as well as a marina, nine top-tier golf courses, more than 100 parks and gardens, world-class dining, year-round mild climate, proximity to capital city Lisbon, and an overall extraordinary quality of life. The seaside city boasts one of the lowest crime rates in Europe and is home to a large and welcoming community of expats. 5. Citta Sant'Angelo, Italy Perched on a hilltop with views of Grand Sasso Mountain, the Adriatic and vineyards and olive groves in between, Sits 9th century Citta Sant'Angelo, in the heart of Italy's Abruzzo region, one of the greenest in Europe, with more than a dozen ski resorts in one direction and 80 miles of coastline in the other. Citta Sant'Angelo has earned the title Borgo, recognizing it as one of Italy's most beautiful cities. 6. Cotter, Montenegro. This tiny seaside country of a half million people dispersed over an area smaller than the state of Connecticut is nestled between Croatia and Albania in southern Europe. Bayside Cotter, surrounded by towering mountains on one side and the dazzling Adriatic on the other, is a UNESCO World Heritage Site and perhaps the best-preserved medieval town in the Mediterranean. The Old Town Square is anchored by the 11th century St. Trifon's Cathedral but its cafes and shops are lively and bustling with a youthful energy. 7. Carcassonne, France Walt Disney is said to have been inspired by its towers, turrets, and ramparts, and you can understand why when the sun rises up over the medieval city of Carcassonne in southeast France. At the heart of Cathar country, this was, for centuries, an important fortification. Today, the city of Carcassonne, capital of the Aude department in the Occitanie region of France, has much to offer tourists and residents, including a medieval castle, St. Nazarius Basilica, boutiques, artist workshops, and Michelin-starred restaurants. Life in the Bastide is centered on the place Carnot, where a produce market is held three times a week, with its pretty fountain, street-side cafes, and restaurants. 
8. Paris, France At home in one of Paris' central, historic neighborhoods, from the first arrondissement to the eighth, the best of city living, from bookstores, antique shops, champagne cellars, parks and gardens to museums, theaters, galleries, five-star restaurants, and luxury shopping, is only a short and pleasant walk away. Central Paris is an open-air museum where little changes yet every day offers the chance for discovery. It's also one of the world's best storehouses of wealth. An apartment of charm in a good location in this city will always find a buyer and a renter, and, on account of Brexit, London wealth is finding its way to the city of light, causing a spike in Paris property values. 9. Papali, Italy Nestled in the valley of three Apennine mountains, Papali, Italy, with a population of about 5,000, is a complete escape from the troubles of the modern world and a sought-out healing center. This medieval town is known as the Cita dell'Acqua, City of Water, thanks to a long dormant volcano that rumbles beneath it, bubbling up thermal spring water famed for its healing properties since the days of the Romans. The first healing center was built on the site in 1885 but destroyed during World War II. The modern term di Papali opened in 1998 and uses the area's thermal waters as the basis for the treatment of dozens of ailments. In high season, the facility sees 1,000 or more patients each day. 10. Valletta, Malta From its weather and food to its history and culture, Malta is not only the best of Mediterranean Europe, but also one of the most affordable options for embracing this lifestyle. This three-island, 122-square-mile nation has been working hard to raise its profile internationally, and Malta's capital, Valletta, was named 2018's European Capital of Culture. The language is English, crime rates are low, and the health care is excellent. Malta does not offer a retiree visa, but its global residence program for non-EU citizens amounts to one of the best residency opportunities in Europe. You can qualify simply by renting a place to live for as little as 800 euros per month. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video make sure to hit that like button. Also subscribe to our channel before you go. Thank you for watching.